I was watching some inspiration of car poster design for the social media. So I was watching this to make something like that. So if you are new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notification. I am saving this one, open this one and saving this one save images and save it out so after that i'll go to the chat gpt and after that i'll take a new chat and here is plus sign add photo i'll add photo i will provide prompt to chat gpt make pro level image to prompt in depth act like a pro prompt engineer and hit the tick button so after providing the prompt i will make modification and everything with my car so let's see what is my car in this section i have a car which is this or i have another car which is like this which is sedan and here they provided me SUV so now I have to tell chat GPT modify the prompt for prompt like a pro prompt engineer and make it for mg5 gt sedan car so after providing this prompt here was suv now chat gpt will make this one for the sedan type yeah they made it copying this one going to the google ai studio and from here I'll upload upload photo and now I'll import or provide this photo open and now I'll provide the prompt use my uploaded photo and make a hyper realistic this prompt okay after providing the prompt let's see what they are providing in the downside of this they are showing us the second how many second uh, nano banana is taking to make so we got this okay i need more action type so i have to tell chat gpt make it more action type then act like a pro so after telling that let's see what chat gpt is providing us fine we are taking this and going to the ai studio and now i will paste it over there and now hit the control enter let's see the next result what is coming up we got this result so saving this out so now we are in photoshop going to the open options so we have our design generated by ai we'll pick up this rather than this because of this one is more action and uh, more aesthetic so opening it up so after open it up we have to make the watermark remove by using here the selection tool and here is the patch tool so we'll make it patch so our watermark gone now time to add some uh, logo over there mg logo new so new mg logo we got it and this one as well so we'll use the black and white one or red one whichever you can use copying this one 
and controller command V and after that here is a magic one tool selecting the white color turning it off controller command D selecting this and delete the white portion that's good now turning up the background controller command T make this one smaller placing in this portion so I would suggest you to make this one white how to make this one logo renaming the layer right press and going to the blending options here is the color overlay option and i'll make it white that's good and hit ok and hit ok so in this portion we can use some like a call to action button suppose call now or something we'll make a button like this better to not use anything i'll just write down over there 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 that's fine changing the font the font will be poppins regular or it will be gilsense regular fine and this one the paragraph will be right alignment and making this one a little bit of a smaller so call now it will be in one line and the color will be white let's make it the white color that's fine so we should use a icon which is for the call so going to flat icon and now i'll use this our call icon is simple free download and saving the icon in my directory that's fine going to the photoshop again going to the file and going to the place embed options i'll use this and placing over there that's fine that will be icon right press the rasterize the layer going to the blending options and color overlay white it could be smaller that's fine and making them into one group which is call that is logo and that will be bg so saving this one saving to our directory like mg5 gt psd and again saving it out into the jpeg version use jpg and hit ok so now you can post it in your social media and you can share with these to the your instagram and uh, your portfolio as well Hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any sort of questions query request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video is when i'm signing out today stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers and bye bye